All right, let's see what the old man's got to say. You know, way over the Tielson Pass. He told me once that I I'd... told you nothing. Go on. Oh, I can't on. help you, Deke. Just draw me a goddamn map. After everything you've done. After everything I've. What about what you've done, old man? Huh? Sherman's you camp. The things that you, you get did. Out hey, of here. You no, listen, me, listen, me. listen to me. What if you could take it all back? Huh? What if you could fix it? I thought I put Sarah on a chopper. I felt relieved. How fucked up is that? Uh, I was relieved. Mike, that's what I've been living with. And now you're chasing ghosts. You think finding your old lady, if she's alive, you think that's gonna fix it? Make you whole? I don't know, but I gotta try. <sighs> All right. If I do this, what you want, show you the way over the pass. You don't come back. All right, you promised me you don't come back. I got you. <sighs> Shit, now I gotta talk to Boozer. In the road, snow and ice. We, we just wait for it to thaw. There's a bunch of abandoned cars. It take forever to get past. No, no, no. And that's the least of our worries. There's a horde. Uh, the biggest one you ever saw. There must be over a thousand. Are you shitting me? It's down there, right off the road to the south. I saw it on my way back. Jesus, what the hell are you doing running off where there's a horde? And you don't even tell me? I didn't know it was there. Makes you wonder why no one else told us shit. Holy Bruce shit. Are right, I... Uh -huh. Huh. Last winter, we were up on Farewell Ridge. We were watching the freaks. Thousands. Thousands of them. I mean, too many to count. Yeah, I remember. All I could think was every one of us, man, woman, and child, are now homeless. A bunch of goddamn refugees. Yeah. World belongs to them now. We'll survive. <laughs> yeah, we've been doing that all right. Surviving isn't living. <laughs> Something Jack used to say. Doesn't matter when you hit the road, where you're heading out to, but you damn well better know where you're coming home to. You know, we never talked about it. While we still wore the colors all this time out in the freak show and shit like this didn't matter anymore. Yeah, yeah but I think. Last two Mongols on Earth, farewell originals. Uh, the biker boys, most badass drifters on the broken road. Damn straight. Yeah, I guess we did become sort of a brand. The, we were a lot of things, but we were never a brand. <laughs> <laughs> when we rode out of farewell without Sarah, without Jack or anyone. I knew that we were leaving everything behind. Everything that mattered was gone. Except this. You're a nomad again, huh? 
Yep, I guess I am. Come on, Jack. Inside, let's go. If she's out there, you can find her. Yeah, Mike, I'm ready. Meet me at the gate. Don't keep me waiting. Yeah, sure, Mike, whatever you say. Hey. Her big Mike is taking you over the pass? Yep. You really think she's still alive? Billions of people are dead, but somehow she made it. Hey, we made it, didn't we? If I give up now, if I don't... If I don't do this... Well, then I'm just gonna end up like, uh... Like us. Right? Like Iron Mike, like Boozer? What'd you call us? Campers, yeah? You go, and you find your woman. You know where to find me. Deacon, I think that you're, you're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here and that scares the hell out of you. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, me too. You ready? Yeah, I want to get the hell out of here. Come on, this way. Okay, I'm following you. Fishing once before, you know. Oh shit. I got one. Didn't know what the hell to do with it. <laughs> that sounds like Jack. Oh, he ran a pretty tight club. Or you boys raised some hell back in the day. I don't think you murdered anyone. Not in cold blood. It's not murder if they shoot at you first. Summer? A few. Thousands. Too many to count. Highway me bumper to bumper with SUVs and campers chock full of sunburned moms, beer chugging dads, and their snot nosed kids. Goddamn rainbow, floppy hats, Hawaiian shirts, and flippy flops. All summer long they come. The 
trail of colorful ants from L.A. to farewell to here, nonstop. I'm glad I avoided road trips out here that time of year. This is as far as I go. Keep following the trail. It'll take you down the mountain, on into the diamond-like valley. I wish you luck. Hope you're right about your old lady still being alive. She is. Well, maybe so. But you gotta ask yourself, Deke. What does it matter if everyone else is dead? You're out there. I'll find you. Mayday! Mayday! Captain Corey? You there? Come in! Mayday! No one's listening. Damn it! Try again! 
What the hell? Razor! No, no, no! Jesus, I don't Mr. know what we would have done without oh, you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, okay, okay. all right, all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Man of the hour. Oh, God. I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Rick. Uh, hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <laughs> What? What the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. Freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. He just killed a freaking ranger, dude. Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him here. Uh, you stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No! Listen, stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? Let's go. Following you. The Shoots County Militia? Look, man, all I know is they feed me. They want me to salute and yes, sir, I salute and say yes, sir. How big's your outfit? We camp out here? We got a hundred, maybe more. Hard to keep track. Back at HQ, a whole lot more than that. Yeah, okay. Uh, any women? Hell, that we were about? Well, you can forget it. Colonel's got rules about that. Frat, fratern, fratern, fraternizing. <laughs> yeah, that. Look, you pull your weight, follow orders, nobody messes with you. Women same as the men. Don't matter to the colonel. I'm not... Uh, listen, I, I'm just... I'm looking for some people and a woman that I rode with a year back or so. They would have come over from Silver Lake, and they would have been at one of those Nero refugee camps, I think. Silver Lake? Jesus, man. Silver Lake's been gone a lot longer than that. Yeah, yeah. It's too goddamn easy to lose track of time out of here, you know? Anyway, you guys, uh... Do you pick anyone up? Survivors, I mean, from uh, from the refugee camp? Maybe. Like I said, it's a big freaking army, you know? Ask the captain. He came in across the salt flats, I think. He might know. Captain? Yeah, Corey. He commands the Diamond Lake outpost. We're almost there. This is it. It's Corporal Russell. Open up. Port. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost him. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with a body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. I sort of promised him some food and a safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. And you are? 
Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. Why, are you interested? I've been looking to settle down. Yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. So, how long have you been drifting? Hard to say. Uh, you lose track of time out there, you know? So, uh, where'd you get your gear? Ammo. Well, there's a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Or men? Both. I had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Oh, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh, Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun? <laughs> uh, yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? Why okay. are you not working hard? Why are you still in my obstacle course? Why are you not finished with my obstacle course? Here. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Jesus, motherfucker has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. Hmm. He doesn't look like militia. 